Are you confused or trying to figure out how to get your Trovo account details into your OBS setti uh, settings and setting it up? Well, I'll show you how to do this with a quick and easy way. Come on, let's go ahead and get this, this started. So I got both a Trovo account and OBS opened up side by side. Now, this is just for keep things simple and easy to understand for everybody and be much, uh, be, be very helpful to try and keep things simple for everybody. Now, what you will need to do is, of course, you need a Trovo account. That is a given. So all you do is sign into your Trovo account at trovo.live. Click on the bar or the little button on the upper right that says log in, enter your details, and then go ahead and log in. Now, what you need is your stream key and host URL. So all you will have to do is go into the upper right, click on your profile picture, click on Creator Studio, and that's gonna open up this page right here. Now, what you need to do is in OBS, is click on Settings, go to Stream, now the service, what you're looking for is custom. And all you're gonna do is copy and paste the host URL into where it says server. The stream key, you copy and paste it. And that is it. Press apply and then okay. So what's gonna happen is once you set up your stream overlays and all sorts of stuff, you'll be able to hit the go live button just as I will do right now. And there you go. You're now live on Trovo. So we'll hit stop. Now, it's not really integrated with OBS. Trovo is not in integrated with OBS at this moment. But with this workaround, you can easily get your account settings and get started. All you will have to do is use another service for your alerts, like Stream Elements, Botrix, or Nightbot, or any of the other uh, bots that are available. Those are the only ones I know of at the time of this recording to bring in the browser source from those into your OBS so you can set up alerts and stuff like that. But until next time, have a good stream and uh, we'll catch you on the next video.